Hey everyone, it's Alberto from the Matthew Wood Institute of Herbalism out on a morning plant walk and bumped into my friend Staghorn Sumac. It is late June and as you can see, the flower of the staghorn is pale green, although some of the seeds are starting to turn pinkish red when it comes to full maturity in early to mid August. This entire flower will be a deep burgundy red. And I encourage you to uh, get out there, connect with the plants and see how they progress through the season. And in this way, you'll slowly uh, get to know them and be able to identify them easily. As its namesake suggests, staghorn sumac is hairy on the stem, just like the horns of a stag. And the leaves are lanceolate or lance-like long and narrow they are serrated dark green on the top and silvery light green on the bottom matthew and phyllis do talk about staghorn sumac quite a bit and its affinities for the urinary tract the kidneys and the bladder specifically if you want to learn more about staghorn sumac or rus typhina then i encourage you to check out some of the classes in herbs a to z as well as the herbs for the kidney and bladder. Have fun out there.